Chelsea have their squad issues. And while Maresca has his methods, how about we use our own with Nuzlocke rules to trim this squad of 40 down. What are they? Well, if you lose a game, three worst average rating players via your starting 11 are sent to the bomb squad. It's just transfer listing and sending your player to the reserve team. Draw a game and the worst rated player is sent. Now there are other ways to be sent to the bomb squad, but we'll get to those when they arrive. If we lose too many players though, and can't field a starting 11, this challenge is done. So let's get started with our tactic for my capital city challenge and begin with Brighton. Well, that's not good. Cole Palmer finished with a 6.4. Uh, all right, well, looks like he's getting sent to the bomb squad. Uh, Palmer, it's simple. He does not fit into my system. Um, he's moved to the under 21 squad. Give, give Palmer one more chance. You, I can't. That's the rules of the challenge. Okay, so this hasn't started well. Next game, Liverpool. I expect a loss here. So let's give other players a chance. All right, we lose. Since we've lost, the three worst players are eliminated. Those three will be Adarabioyo, Harvey Vale, and David Washington. All right, so those four are gone now. Nice. I'm going to try to lose the second leg, but first leg, we should be fine. There we go. But we will try to lose the second leg just so we're not in the conference league, but we'll have to sacrifice some players. Why am I trying to lose? This is why I'm trying to get eliminated from the conference league. My job doesn't matter about European trophies. That doesn't matter. Just sacrifice three players. You don't have to play 16 games extra. That means less chances to fail this challenge. It may be stupid, but that's just how it is. I've done I've done the, these challenges with PSG and Bayern, Champions League in both. Annoying. But we got United next. We'll play this one. We'll have to sim the one later in the year. Already unrealistic because Sterling is getting starts. Hey man, we're not Maresca, we're Kureska. Well, that's not a good start. Afternoon, what's good, Ritz Ritsuko? What's good, man? Boom! Moises Caicedo. What a golazo. Let's go. We can defeat United easy. Get it to Sterling. Prove these... Okay, that was really bad, Sterling. What were you doing there? I see why Maresca doesn't play Sterling. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm starting to realize that as well. Chil Chilwell, Caicedo, Enzo. Boom! Another goal. Onana in the mud. Now with my genius three-back system. We will see ourselves getting up the pitch, using the wings, leaving the midfield open, allowing the runners from midfield to get through. Or Maurice James just shoots. <laughs> oh crap, don't let Zerg Z score. Get a foot on that, guys. Oh, get it to Nkunku, come on. Bro, how? So this hasn't been an ideal start to the Premier League. 6.3 from Fofana is the worst rating from the starting 11. That is really bad because he's the best defender on the team. Oh gosh. We're losing ballers because of your incompetence. Yes. Look, we're currently near relegation where Chelsea are expected to finish, but we should be mid-table. Conference League, it's risky. We could lose some good players, but hopefully the way we're gonna do it, we're gonna concede a lot of goals and just get the keepers eliminated. All right, who's eliminated? Okay, Broha finished with a 5.6. Bergstrom finished with a 5.4. And Keppa finished on a 5.7. So those are the ones eliminated. Now the challenge can begin, truly. This challenge will now be easy. Joao Felix needs to rob Mudrik's number 10 ASAP. <laughs> yeah, I will play this Newcastle game. Uh, we will not lose. All right, let's do it. Newcastle. Uh, oh, they got Tenali back from suspension. Good for them. Uh, yay, yay. What was that? Oh, <laughs> uh, we're getting absolutely rocked out of this house. Holy. Is this what bad morale does? <laughs> Dewsbury Hall, come on, man. Ankara Dewsbury Hall. Wow. How does that even go in? I say it one more pass. There we go, and Kunku. Okay, we lose a player, and that player from the starting 11 is Kukurea. Uh, we're currently in 16th. Luckily, United are with us, but we've lost nine players now. We're starting to run out of starters. How difficult is the start to the season? Brighton, Liverpool, United, Newcastle, Arsenal, United again? Give me a break. The plan was to play a weak lineup in order to sacrifice worse players. Arsenal away is one of the tougher fixtures, so I thought now was the time. 2-0 to Arsenal. It might be worse, man. <laughs> okay, this is a problem. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like 5-0. Oh, crap. I didn't look who got eliminated. Bettinelli, Fofana, and Vega. Wow. Now, I think we actually take this seriously and try to win every game. Hey, at least we've sent the right... You know, we're trimming the squad down. 
That's a positive, right? You know, this is more manageable. 28 players. We got this now. Good thing Ipswich is the next game. <laughs> We're 20th? <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right, 28 players left. Can we finally get our first victory of the season against Ipswich Town? So there's a Tyreek George skill comp. We're only 39 seconds into the game. How have you managed to injure yourself? So he might be eliminated from the challenge. Here we go. Get a win here, get a win there. Get three wins in a row, and we'll be able to turn the season around. All right, and so Oh, what a goal. Enzo Golazo, not his first of the season. But that's just me playing devil's advocate as we make it 3-0. Oh, shoot, what the heck? Okay, Sanchez is bad. We are helping out Hot Bully and Egg Bali very much with the amount of players we've gotten rid of already that, are, that have been sent to the bomb squad. But we gotta try to limit those numbers as Nkunku gets a goal. Nice. He'll be gone by January. Either we finish the season or we're sacked. And if I get sacked, then that's just typical Chelsea, you know? There we go. We finally won a game, but that means nobody is eliminated, which means we're good. Except Neto might be injured. If Neto is injured and cannot make the bench for the next game, he is out of this challenge. <laughs> Off to the bomb squad you go, mate. All right, we play United next. I wish this game wasn't on the schedule. Pedro Neto out forever, and then Joao Felix can start. We got a corner kick, chill well. Whip it in. Disassi. Very nice. Bro, we let Anthony score on us? I mean, that should just end the challenge right there. Generally, Anthony scored, I think five players should go. <laughs> I mean, there's a better chance we're gonna get sacked. And there we go, Nicholas Jackson makes it two to one. Oh no, don't let Rashford shoot. Oh my days, that is terrible defending. Shalba's in danger. We'll figure it out if the game ends in a draw because it would go to a shootout afterwards. Okay, so let's make this rule here. If you finish the 90 minutes of a match and it's a draw and it goes to extra time or penalties, uh, you lose one player because look, you drew. That's the rule, you drew after 90 minutes. But if you end up losing the game, you lose an additional player. I think it'd be a bit harsh to lose three players after playing 120 minutes or losing in a shootout. All right, penalty shootout. We'll lose one player, but who will it be? And will it be an additional one? Bruno, what a pen. Oh, well, he's good here. Okay, Rashford. Jeez, what a pen. Enzo? You should lose a player every time they miss. No. Nicholas Jackson. Whew. I don't know what that says. Uh, Garnacho. Oh, I barely got that in. Reese James now to equal it at four. Okay. Casemiro. Can Petrovic save it? Off the post and in. All right, it's all good. We have Raheem the Dream. Raheem the Dream. Come on, Raheem. You got this, man. Okay, Mazaruri for United. 6-5 now. Okay, chill well, man. Okay, actually, here's how about this. Let's say the penalty taker who misses the penalty or is the reason why we lost. Let's say he's eliminated. Okay, let's keep it going. Martinez. Oh, he scores. Oh, please don't be... Don't miss Caicedo. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Okay, Hoyland. Let's go! All right, take this penalty and score, and we win. The Sassi, he's good at scoring from corner kicks. What, what about from pens? United are out, we're through. So from the starting 11, which are these guys, the worst rating is either Shalaba or Romeo Lavia, which isn't ideal, that, that's good depth for both sides. I say a coin flip, we'll decide this. Heads for Shalba, tails for Lavia. There we go. All right, tails means Lavia is eliminated, which isn't ideal because we don't have a lot of midfield depth. So that's another to the list. What is this bull crap? Stop giving me all the tough teams to start the season. United third round of the Carabao Cup. Arsenal fourth round. What the heck is this? Literally, there's Lincoln available. Fleetwood. Stockport. Reading. Crystal Palace. I kind of want to play this one just in case. So yeah, we'll see what we can do. Joao. Good ball. All right. Mudrik, Nicholas Jackson. Best friends. Here we go. Gusto on the right. Caicedo, let's go. Uh, but we win and no one leaves. So let's move on to the next game. All right, so seven games through, we're back in eighth 
good stuff. We might actually sim a couple more of these games in a row, but we'll, we'll see depending on the Southampton result. Honestly, yeah, simulate the match. We should be fine. All right, Gay 6.3, Mudrik 6.4, and Caldwell 6.5. Those are the three lowest players. They are eliminated. Bro, I thought this was a sure win. Nothing is ever sure with Chelsea. You got that right. Okay, I guess we'll actually play this Brentford game. Just quick pick it. Brentford with Ivan Tony. Can we do it? Can we get a win away from home? Come on, please be offside. Okay. Oh my gosh. Dewsbury Hall, you're so trash, man. How are you losing it? What exactly is this challenge? It looks like you're doing a regular Chelsea save. Oh my. There's our best goal scorer, or our, one of our top two scorers, DeSassi. Save us from just one of the players being eliminated. Jackson. Jackson. Come on, man. One, find the pass. Penal! Yes, 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 yes. Come on, Nkunku. Come on, man. All right, we survive. At least we don't lose three players here. 96 minute penalty, my word. Not perfect, but we get a draw. We lose a player. Who is it? So either Raheem, Nicholas Jackson, or Shalaba. Let's have the chat vote who leaves. Jackson got half the votes, damn. You guys really want to see Lukaku play? I will probably play the best team possible against Bournemouth and instant result it. 3xG and we don't win. Reese James? All uh, right, move to under 21 squad and transfer list. That will surely not piss off anyone. I wonder what the board thinks of you. Uh, D. <laughs> Supporters? Oh, they're, they're, they like me a bit better. I mean, Arsenal, got to play the best team possible. We can't embarrass the Stamford Bridge fans. Although, still no shots after 70 minutes. We might be on track to lose João Felix, Madueke, or Nkunku. But that would be okay in the grand scheme of things. We are facing the rest defense experts after all. What a ball. What? What happened there? On the brink of losing three players because of Arsenal again, I made several adjustments, leading to a free kick. Moments later. All right, free kick, Dewsbury Hall. Oh, genius play. Badia Schiele. Love that. Best goal scorer at Chelsea Football Club. First shot of the game. <laughs> All right, we lose another player. It could be two if we lose the shootout, but yeah, we don't have as good penalty takers because I took most of them off. Badia Schiele, our best goal scorer up first. Take that, Ramsdale and Arteta and whoever is on Arsenal. Saka. Ooh, he sent Sanchez the wrong way. Lukaku, number 29. <laughs> Lukaku to make it 2-1. to one. This man hates Chelsea, man. All right, I mean, if Arsenal score the rest of their pens and that's the losing pen, then Lukaku is out. Kassadame, we need you to keep us alive. But we're in a dire situation as we're about to be eliminated and lose two players. Sterling stepping up. He actually scores it. If Arsenal scores this, it's over. Now, Fabio Vieira. All right. Worst rated player and the game losing penalty, which was Lukaku, because it was the first one missed, and they didn't miss any. So who was the worst player on the pitch? 6.5 from Sanchez, 6.4 from Gusto, 6.3 from Nkunku, and 6.3 from Chilwell. Okay, I figured out how we determine the elimination. We determine it by alphabetical order by their first name. Player that comes first in alphabetical order stays, and that is Ben Chilwell. So Nkunku and Lukaku, you are gone. Piss off. Now the best under 21 squad in the league. Now to be fair, we did lose a penalty shootout there, but we actually saved one extra player. If Bade Shile did not score in the 90th minute on our first shot in that game, we would have lost three players. We're gonna go like this. Uh, can we survive another day, please? Okay, uh, nothing happened that game. Nil-nil, uh, which means we lose one player. It's not our defender. It is Raheem Sterling. Took longer than expected, I suppose, but Raheem the Dream Sterling with a 6.3 match rating is out of this challenge. Everton, simulate this match. Can I survive? Another damn draw. Why can't the backline keep a clean sheet? 6.3. It's Angelo. Another winger bites the dust. Goodbye, Angelo. Imagine the squad mor morale in real life. One bad match. U21's in transfer listed. <laughs> yeah. 
that's not ideal. Although it's, it's easy to improve club morale when you have less players. Although I am going to have to just sim day by day, just in case Bully knocks on my door and says, we need to talk. The board wished to hold a meeting with you regarding the concerning lack of support from players towards you. This is real concern that the players have lost confidence in you and your position is under serious threat as a result. In my opinion, you're overperforming. <laughs> We're increasingly concerned that you appear to have lost the support of the players at the club and want to know what, if anything, you tend to do about it. Look, I know what's happening. I, I can resolve it. We're prepared to offer you some time to make things right, but we'll be watching very closely in hope of seeing tangible signs of progress. Now let's officially get to the city game and not click on our under 21 squad. So this is our plan. Switch you two around, go cautious. This could be the end, boys, but let's see what happens. Submit the team, let's go. Highlight is appearing. What's gonna happen from this? Surely, no! What can I say to? What is, oh, what the heck? <laughs> How did they miss that? We're surviving. Okay. Mm, Doku never scores, Never mind. Well, we lost 1-0. Thank you, Doku. I appreciate that. Uh, we lose three players. And the three stars that we lose are Kellyman, Madueke, and Gusto. Which means we have no more right backs. <laughs> oh, gosh. We literally will not be able to fill a starting 11 if we lose two more games or if we lose one game and draw one. Outlasted Lopetegui. Did we? Let's go. Fulham, this might be the actual last game. Outside of Petrovic, the morale's not too bad. Now, granted, we could still be screwed because I'm playing players out of position, including Libero Chilwell. Fulham, here they come. Chelsea U21s win against the first team. This could be the last ever lineup. I mean, the defense is still, like, decent. <laughs> oh, Chilwell to Desassi. 1-0 Chelsea. Chilwell Libero is the key. Enzo. Ja, Felix! What a goal! Is it onside though? Check the review. 2 0. You really are happy over 2 0 against Fulham? Of course I am! Have you seen our team? I'm using Chilwell as a libero. Oh, Fulham. You can always rely on Fulham for a win. And this is where you turn around your morale. You have a very small squad, a tight knit group, and you get wins and things improve. Kureska's tactical gamble pays off. Yes. <laughs> Alright. Oh, great. It's Tottenham next. Here we go. There's Spurs. Who is Wilson Obodert? This is not good. Attack, 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 and attack. Support. <laughs> Goodbye, Nuzlocke. Not yet. Not yet. Well, imagine a loss and a red card. Okay, that'd be painful. Oh, no. No. Well, it's basically over. <laughs> 6.2s from Felix Chukawameka. And we'll get rid of Jorgensen because he's a keeper. <laughs> You lasted longer than I expected, Zhao, but you're gone. So that means we are down to 11 players. Single draw ends this challenge. I mean, this actually might be it. 11 players left, no substitutes. Started with 40 players, down to 11, and we face Jamie Vardy's Leicester. Yikes, we're down 1-0 already. This is not good. This is so not good. Manager. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, is it off? Is there a foul? Did anything bad happen there? Goal review. It's over. It's 3-0. And there are three players on 6.3s. So that means Enzo moved to the under-21 squad. Anjorin moved to the under-21 squad. And finally, Petrovic. You tried your best, but you're not a striker. That leaves us with officially eight players. 32 eliminated. I gave myself 40 players. We still failed this challenge miserably. Didn't even get to January. We failed. Top score, Jackson and Nkunku. Best player, Badia Shile. Chilwell and Mudrik with the most assists. 13th place in the Premier League after 16 games. If you want to try this challenge, let me know how you do. I'll leave the rules and requirements in the description down below. But to end things off, on Twitch here, we're going to resign from Chelsea. 07s, boys. <laughs>